In this video, we will discuss interesting case of projectile motion and we call it monkey problem. A monkey hanging on a tree is shot by a tranquilizer by taking a direct aim. So, uh, this is a mischievous monkey. That is why we are, you know, shooting it by using a tranquilizer so that it loses its sense and we are able to catch it. But what happens as soon as the shot is fired, the monkey loses the grip and starts falling. Question is whether the shot will be able to hit the monkey or not. Now let's visualize the problem. This is a monkey and this is your gun and you take a direct aim, which is normally we do when we shoot anything. Now what happens as soon as you fire this shot because of the sound, this fellow starts falling down. Will the shot be able to hit the monkey? That's the question here. Now just pause the video and think. Probably some of you may be able to get answer to this riddle. It's a kind of riddle. It's a very interesting question. Now the height of the monkey is H and the distance is D from place where we are shooting it. Now in order to hit the monkey, what should happen? The moment you fire the shot, the shot will go in this direction and monkey will start falling. And if both reach the same place, then only monkey is going to be hit. Now suppose your gun, your shot reaches, your bullet reaches this place. And since it is going in a projectile motion, it is going like this. And the monkey is still at this place. So, uh, shot is not going to hit the monkey. So, for the bullet to hit the monkey, this position has to be same. That is, when your bullet reaches this place, you know, in the vertical line just below the monkey, if you draw a vertical line, the monkey also has to be at that position. Then only it's going to hit the monkey like this. We are assuming that the shot is going to hit the monkey. So, what is the condition that the monkey will get hit? The bullet will cover a horizontal distance of D and it will reach this place. And when it reaches this place, monkey and bullet has to be at the same place. Suppose the monkey falls by a height H and the position of this bullet is H dash, the vertical uh, distance. So, for monkey to get hit, H plus H dash should be equal to H. If we are able to prove this, that means monkey is bound to be hit by the shot. Now let P be the time required by bullet or shot to travel horizontal distance of D, this distance. Now if the velocity of the shot is u and this angle is theta, you have u cos theta and u sin theta. That means u cos theta into t should be equal to d. t is equal to d upon u cos theta. This is equation 1. 
Now in the same time monkey is going to fall by a height h. Now h is equal to half g t square and h dash uh, for the this projectile the shot we consider the vertical motion so h dash is equal to u sin theta n to t minus half g t square this is your second and this is your third now from second and third if you add them v t square half g t square gets cancelled so h plus h dash is equal to u sin theta into t and u sin theta into t is d upon u cos theta so h plus h dash is equal to d into tan theta now what is tan theta it's capital h upon d so that means h plus h dash is equal to h so this indicates that monkey will surely get hit by the shot some people may have one question a small doubt which uh, i have seen some of my students asking how is it possible even if you are at a very great distance you know then only then also will the monkey get hit no suppose take a hypothetical case that you are very far from the monkey and uh, so much distance you are away from the monkey that monkey is beyond the range of your shot so then what will happen your shot will go like this and monkey will fall like this because you are very far However, it's not possible to take a aim from uh, that far because normally for these tranquilizers, uh, uh, generally the distance, uh, the range uh, uh, is uh, nearly 70 meters. So it's not possible for us to take a direct aim beyond 70 meters. So uh, when we are taking a aim, that means we are very close and monkey is within the range of our uh, shot. So monkey is bound to get hit. I hope. Some of you might have uh, got the correct answer. Congratulations to them. And uh, even uh, the people who have not got the answer, they will find it quite interesting. Now you may wonder why the monkey will get hit. Why uh, we can say that with certainty we can say that monkey is going to get hit because both are falling with the same acceleration due to gravity. That is. That's all. In this video, hope you found it interesting. Thanks for watching.